Hey guys, Stephen Max here, and this is WWE 2K17 Rant, Last Gen Rant. Okay, so let's start off here. Okay, so last year we got WWE 2K16. We got, um, I mean for la Last Gen, we got a little bit of a graphic update for 2K, I mean, I mean for um, Last Gen, and we got... We got Universe Mode, and we got the uh, Austin 316 Mode. So, um, yeah. But, and in 2K15, I mean, that game was terrible, but we still had some more features, you know. We had, like, who got an XD Mode and so forth for last gen. Well, not that much. But, let's talk about 2K17. It doesn't look like we're going to get jack shit this time. It looked like we only get universe mode and you know this title exhibition mode and so forth. And that's gonna be it. What kind of bullshit is this? I mean, I know the last gen, you know, you could say, oh it's old, you have to upgrade. Well, you know some people ain't got money to upgrade, so you gotta think about that 2K, people ain't got money to upgrade, and you still charge full price for it. I just went on Amazon.com WWE 2K17 um, last gen um, pre order and it's still $59.99. So tell me, I for $59.99, I'm just paying for universe mode and exhibition mode. What kind of bullshit is this? Because for um, Brock Lesnar, I mean, there's no nothing for Brock Lesnar. I mean, there's no, there's no, um, like, what you used to call it. Ah. Oh. They used to never be so. What am I talking about? I know. Uh, not not anything. Not gonna end. Not anything. We're just gonna have universe mode. Goddamn exhibition! I'm saying this over and over again because there's a goddamn ripoff. I mean, some people still play last gen. You still make money off it. Why don't you make a good damn product than making shit? And you expect people to buy shit for full price? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Let me say you call it like a $30 US. $30 US sound like a good price for, um, for thing. But you can't charge full price and we only get in universe and exhibition mode. I mean, we might get some creation mode or so, but, you know, that still ain't mean nothing. I mean... Oh my god, it's, 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 it sucks. It really does suck. Because we're not gonna get my career. I mean... Whew. God, man, your last year... Yeah, 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 y'all... 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 Y'all PS4 and Xbox One players are goddamn lucky right now. Because we gotta play... We, Xbox 360 and PS3 players... We... Still... Got to do this same old shit. Pay full price for goddamn nothing. Look at last year. I mean, last year wasn't so bad. But last year you had Stone Cold Steve Austin mode. So you could at least charge like a five to four dollars or something. I mean, that would not be a bad price. You know, you still had 120 characters. I mean, um, superstars. So that's good. Unless you had something to play through. You had universe. But now, only this year, there's no, there's no nothing, there's nothing, only universe, and only goddamn, um, oh, thanks, <sighs> an exhibition mode, and if, and if you're like a, a casual fan, a, a, a fan, I mean, a, well, not really a fan, but just like to play these wrestling games, I, I strongly want, and I strongly, you need to play games like for last gen, and, and and you got only last gen, you got new gen. Well, just well, just go out, go to Amazon.com, buy a copy of WWE 2K13 or WWE 2K, I mean WWE 13 or WWE 2K14 or WWE 12. I mean those are good games. And we understand what is it gonna take just to add some more things into last gen. Like a little bit of a little bit of something man. A little bit of like 
a little mini career mode or something. I mean, it doesn't have to be all the features, just a little bit, or season mode or something. You know, you don't have, you don't need any voice acting or so. All we need is just, you know, you go through matches, you win championships, you get storylines and so forth. Season mode, you know, like how we had in the old SmackDown vs Raw games. But no, we get shit. And only the, the, um, the PS4 and Xbox One players get my career mode. Which I think is still bullshit. Oh, it really pisses me off though. I mean, sure you could say, yeah, we need to upgrade. Alright, fine. But yeah, again, I'm making this point again. Some people think I might upgrade. Like me. I got Xbox 360 and I ain't got money to upgrade. Because, well, <laughs> I don't really work. Well, I am not. And I don't really work because I'm still in school and I don't really work. And I can't really ask my parents to buy one of those for me, can I not? Because they're, they're too expensive. So, <laughs> I guess I just gotta wait till I start working till I get a new. till I get a PS4 or Xbox One. Or Xbox Scorpio, whatever is out. Okay, so that was my rant. If I, if you're just a casual fan, I mean, not, not a casual fan, just like you don't really like the product, but you just like to play these wrestling games. I give you choices: WWE 12, WWE 2, um, 13, and WWE 2K14. Trust me, those are the three best games you could get. Or if you or who well that would be the most new games. Don't buy. I mean, 2K15. If you really, really want 2K15, which in the characters are just limited and so forth, I think you shouldn't buy it. But you know, but if you wanted something more new, I would say you would buy like 2K16. I mean, you're still getting Stone Cold Steve Austin mode. Then like 2K17, you're getting jack shit. It's going to get the universe mode and exhibition mode. So, alright, that was my rant. I think I'm going to end this and upload this and so forth. And that was it for now.